Do you like Trumps? Trump or Trumps? <laughs> well, now that you mentioned the Big Daddy himself, what is your opinion on that guy? You don't want to say? What about trams? you like trams? Let's get in this tram, let's get in this tram. Do you like them? Yes. Good day guys, welcome back. My name's Matt and join me today. We're going to War Island, taking a ferry from New Belgrade. And I'm going to show you a few clips of nightlife here in Belgrade from last night. And we might go to another bar today, so I'll see you over there. Easy. One is just here. To go to Turkey, so. Does that building remind you of Kharkiv? Yeah. A little hometown. bit, yeah? Hometown. Represent. Look at this. I just wanted to show you guys a nice area here in Belgrade with new developments. This whole building is a modern apartment. And underneath you have really nice supermarkets. You have a biomedical center. You have a few parks. Yeah, this is Maxi. It's a very popular supermarket here in Serbia. You want to sit here? Sure, if you want. Let's check out the menu. We were thinking of going to Medusa, which is my favorite coffee shop of all of Belgrade so far. Uh, but this place looks nice. Looks like a decent place to put your laptop down and get some work done. Pastries, pastries and stuff. Divided by 117. Sandwiches. Oh, that looks good, eh? Eat happy, eat hearty, eat eco friendly. No, thank you. Look, look how tiny mine is. <laughs> it seems like shit here. Yeah, I need something, but I'll get it the last day that we're in Belgrade. They exited that at a pharmacy that you saw, and they were the most rude employees that I've ever had to deal with at a pharmacy. They were like, hey, you do not have permission to film these products from the pharmaceutical companies. And I was like, well, yeah, I don't work at Pfizer, I don't work at Moderna, so I guess we don't have permission. The medical mafia doesn't want you to see this. Over here, there's a nice garden juice bar. Literally everything under this building. GameStop here, if you want to play some games. But I, I would personally recommend Peter's Net Cafe instead of this place. Just my personal opinion. What can I say? They're gonna make you some traditional Greek Cypriot frappe if you go to Net Escape Cafe. So it's your choice. There's a supermarket. There's everything you could want. Sorry. Let's check for chocolate. Yeah, I guess we can check for chocolate here. I just learned that yod in Russian means iodine. I bought this for 64 Serbian dinar. It's a really good price. Behind me is that amazing apartment that I keep going on about, like a broken record. But I have to, I'm at the medical mafia now, so I have to go. Where can you find selenium in natural sources like food? What is this, by the way? So this place is called Business Garden. So it does look modern from every angle until you reach this building here. And then you're like, okay, we're in Serbia still. Uh, but I didn't say it's not beautiful. You know, I do appreciate the beauty of the old architecture as well as the beauty of the new architecture. So we will know Serbia and all the locations like our homes. Already kind of like recognize a few places in many streets, which is cool. Hey guys, I arrived in New Belgrade and boy does it look different. It is much more socialist. The buildings are just obvious. I'm on my right there's a park which borders the river and I'm gonna take a ferry somewhere here. Honestly I have no idea where to find uh, Nicola so 
let's hope for the best let's hope i don't get lost and let's see what today is gonna offer guys i have no idea where he is he abandoned me in this socialist village little update i'm not abandoned i found them and we're waiting for the ferry the weather is perfect today by the way yeah. hello <laughs> hello <Hi. laughs> i'm harassing these two gentlemen all the time no with my we're, camera. Harass we're harassing you <laughs> me you from the house <laughs> no I'm, I'm really happy that i i can get to go out and uh, this type of architecture in our area She told us that uh, uh, actually the elevator was never better. Oh. So fast, efficient, yeah. never gets stuck. <laughs> and it's fast, you know, you get... <laughs> <laughs> right, right. You see, remind me of what I went in, in Moscow and in Kharkiv in Ukraine. Yes. So the elevators, they just, you got in and <clears throat> it boosted you up as if like it was thrown into the air. Like so, so I know what you mean, yeah, yeah, yeah. <laughs> All right, so we are approaching the river. This is no fat, no stress. <laughs> no, because I don't know people, and you're in the middle of you. No. no luck. No. Our plan is uh, available like during the day. Uh, we need uh, to call the day before when we want to. to go. Oh, it's okay. All right. Uh, so plan B for taking a kayak is also not on the table and uh, it's my fault because I wanted to come late to the island so we have to try another time uh, New Belgrade arose and this is New Belgrade but it's considered as a salmon Okay Administratively but it's not, right? It doesn't look like salmon It looks like... It's just here, very close, like uh, and there's five minutes a... Are there new developments like now in the 2020s? In Zemun? Yes uh, yes, but not in center, not in city center. Okay. But the other credits. Hey guys, so um, I'm really happy to show you my favorite cafe in all of Belgrade, Cafe Medusa. And no, it's not because I have a Medusa tattoo. It's because it's a great place to sit down. You can have your laptop set out. The coffee is a great price. It's bright if you're on the first floor. Second floor is not bright at all. And they serve, they're like a cafe bar. So, the atmosphere is different than any regular cafe. So yeah, I'm gonna show you guys, it's right in front of us. On the left. <laughs> I just wanted to ask if you have pastries, like croissants or something. Just brownies and cookies. Brownies? Yeah. Okay. okay. I will check the menu. Here's the menu that I wanted to show. So we've arrived here at Monkey Bar. It's part of an old building right next to McDonald's and opposite a pizza store. You have to climb bricks and hug trees to get here. But nevertheless, this is where we've arrived. Ooh, Portuguese towels again. Love that. I didn't expect people to be here on a Wednesday, but it looks pretty full. Should we go? Yeah, I'm waiting when you open the door. Okay, I have to open the door. Alright, let's go. Hello. Hi, hi. Hey, hey man. How are you? I'm good. Hey, man. How are you? And so, how's the fat? Is it big fat? No. No, I mean, is it fat? So like, like how many big? grams? Yeah. Oh, yeah. It's very, very stressful. <laughs> They're just uh, working in some industry, you know, or in the field. So, in Belgrade, you have a Belgrade which is on the east side of Sava River and you have a new Belgrade and Zemun which is on the west side yeah. and uh, it used to be two different cities until they merged and you will see in Zemun for example in this west side 
people who never crossed the bridge. They hate Belgrade. <laughs> They're like uh, local patriots. Wow. Never crossed the bridge in their life. So it's very interesting and I, I, I can feel them because the other <laughs> side is never better. For me, at least. Yeah. It's a different it's Central Europe uh -huh. and this is Balkans. Uh, I guess so. You. It's also, and the other side was always under Austria, and this side was always under Turkey. So <laughs> we would always have this uh, conflict between the two sides. You can build a kitty. So even though in Cyprus, I'm fine. So I'm still in Monkey Bar Belgrade and they have really cool drinks, non-alcoholic. They even have a Freddo Espresso, which you can see right here. Uh, explicitly Greek Cypriot coffee drink. I don't have any alcohol because I'm still recovering from this mystery flu. And in the urinal, in the men's toilet, they put a plant there. I'll show you guys. Everything is floral and here's the plant. I don't want to go too close, but that used to be a urinal at one point. So now we're off to another place. We, I suggested to go to another bar, but we're gonna go to an American looking burger place. And maybe they have drinks there, so see you over there. Large church. Uh, the largest the church? church. Uh, yeah, this used to be the largest uh, Orthodox temple. They mm -hmm. started building, it's not yet finished, I believe. Okay. But that's, until the Romanian one, it used to be the largest, so. <laughs> okay, and what's the name of this one? Uh, yeah, Temple of Saint Sava is the one who brought Christianity into Serbia. Oh, that's interesting. Right. Cafe Pizzeria Maggiore. Let's see how it is. So full of bella. You want dobro bella vino domaci? Homemade. Uh, homemade. White. Homemade. Okay, is it sweet or is it dry? Is it uh, that is sweet or is it dry? Is it uh, that is sweet? Uh, no, it's not sweet. 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 It's uh, also kind of a uh, milk product, mm. but it's uh, also characteristic for these areas. All right. So you will taste it, and I hope. Well, let's see if yeah. you like it, but I don't want to tell anything, but this is my favorite. Yeah. So. Okay. <laughs> Are you serious? <laughs> no, I'm not serious. No, I'm serious. Dobro, šta ima to Ima paradise crust. Ima Serbian beer. Yeah. Okay. Yeah. Uh, let's see. How do you pronounce that? Zayetsharska? Yeah. Zayetsharsko. Zayetsharsko. Yeah. Lager. Yeah. I like more uh, wheat. He likes wheat, wheat but, but yeah. uh, don't uh, produce. Uh, Fine. So, what, what water would you recommend in Serbia? You, uh, you said the Rosa? Yes, Rosa. It's called uh -huh. Aroese uh -huh. uh, because it comes from the best quality springs in Serbia. All right. And also Knjaz Miloš. Uh, Rosa uh, is from southern Serbia. Prolom. Very, very. Uh -huh. And also, yes, a good idea. Prolom. Mm -hmm. It's best uh, water in Serbia. It's, um, not an acidic, but base. The opposite. Uh -huh. Base water. And uh, it comes also from springs. Okay. And it's uh, the healthy water, you know, yeah. the doctors recommend it. <laughs> yeah. Really? So you know that it's also smoking. Yeah. 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 And uh, this water, want to buy Elon Musk actually. Really? Yeah. <laughs> uh, before uh, one week, I mm -hmm. uh, read the news on my mobile phone and I uh, see uh, how you say um, Musk. Musk want to buy Serbian water. <laughs> A fake news. Click it's a clickbait. But uh, actually, it's uh, what this water have a uh, uh, natural uh, yod. 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 I don't know. Yod. Uh, iod, uh, yod. Iodine. Iodine. It's particularly important, uh, I think, for nuclear fallout. Yeah. Like yeah. in terms of nuclear war, yes. yeah. you want to suck up an iodine. Yeah. So. And, oh, I don't know. Uh, okay. and which one? Good for your which one? Land, uh, 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 any of them. It's a juice. Thyroid. 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 Yeah, yeah. yeah. It's a juice. So you don't have to eat salt. Uh -huh. You can just drink this water. Zelo. Zelo, kako je veliko? 
Alright guys, the food arrived. I don't know what this is called. So what, what is this dish over here? This is Piaskovica. Piaskovica? Yes, Piaskovica. Mm -hmm. And this one is Chevapi. Yeah. This is Chevapi. This yeah. is the one that everyone told me to get. Yeah. Yeah. <laughs> okay. But uh, uh, it's similar. Mm -hmm. But uh, with Piaskovica, which we ordered this time, it's spicy. <laughs> I have my wine. This is my meal. <laughs> A glass of wine. <laughs> Serbian wine. Homemade wine, by the way. No, Serbian yeah. food, local Serbian music. <laughs> local patriot, yes, yes. So this is Kaimak. Yes. Ice exactly. cream looking thing. So, uh... The meat is really spicy. It tastes really good. It's like a, a circular thing. And uh, the dairy, which I forgot the name, it's co gonna complement it, so I won't kaimak, die spicy. Kaimak. The kaimak. kaimak. The kaimak is gonna help, I hope, because in the first bite, I already feel it. So, bon appetit. Okay, left. It's a really different part. Hey, I wonder what the area is called. Yeah. Nicola, do you know what the area of this place is called? Uh, this area? Yeah, this area. Bracar. Bracar. Mm -hmm. Yeah, we were totally unknown to this place. Bracar yeah. is, is the uh, most expensive part of the city. Even more than Dort, yeah. uh, Dortcha? Everything. Uh, here, this is the most expensive okay. part. Okay. Cool. Bracar is a doctor, actually. Oh, yes, Bracar means doctor. Yeah. Doctor. <laughs> <laughs> Mr. Nicola, <clears throat> I have to ask you uh, again, because I keep getting harassed on my account that I referred to Gopniks in Serbia. Yeah. Uh, I know you guys don't have Gopniks in Serbia, but what term would you use to supplement that, if there's any? Like, there isn't really. There's Sorry. <laughs> nothing at all? <laughs> the only the Dizel Dizelashi uh -huh. is the only one, but they're gone. But that's in the past, yeah. yeah. That's in the past. So you would just say like uh, skinheads or something? Uh, uh, hooligans. Just hooligans. Only those which uh, sports Serbian teams. hooligans. Yeah, okay. hooligans. All right. <coughs> but not all sport teams have them, or do No, no. Okay. Only the bigger, the bigger one. Uh -huh. <laughs> Without rice? Oh. Uh, okay, multiverse. Yeah, let's wait for these boys. So, this is the old alphabet of Serbian. Kind of looks like Russian and Georgian. I wouldn't like say Hebrew. Rectangle Arabic. <laughs> rectangle Arabic. That would be uh, Hebrew. Rectangle Arabic. You know, because Georgian is a bunch of squiggles with like hoops and loops and stuff. This is the same, but just more geometric and more sharp and edgy. Yeah. Yeah. People. Behind me is a really nice renovated cafe bar that operates close to midnight. And this area is, as Nicola said, is called Doctor in Serbian. I forgot the word. Um, but this is a really great place with a lovely atmosphere. And prices are still very great, even in the most posh uh, areas. <laughs> Good evening guys, we just ended our night, we went to that monkey bar place right now, we had like a two hour political discussion, and uh, we made some plans to go to War Island tomorrow, so that's going to be an exciting journey to go on. We had amazing food, we had good drinks, and uh, we discovered a new part of Belgrade that is very nice, and as you can see, we're walking in the streets of Belgrade, close to midnight, in uh, a typical socialist a socialist neighborhood and everything is fine we feel safe and if i get stabbed right now well that's just an anomaly don't worry probably won't happen to you but yeah um thanks i'm gonna end the video here so thanks for watching please give this video a like if you've enjoyed it and subscribe for more content goodbye guys Vida toda oscura Sin tu amor no viviré Ajá, palm trees
<laughs> kind of. <laughs> kind of, kind of. Uh, cute ones. <laughs> Found and then this uh, type, which is northern. Uh. <laughs> a medical mafia woman who worked at the pharmacy just entered the bus and she was staring at us. She's wondering why we're talking to a camera and why we're laughing at stuff. Funny, yeah? What can I add one thing? So we were crossing from Hungary to uh, to here in Serbia, and there was a Turkish police officer. And they had the Turkish flag badge, and the way that it was spelled was polis, like how they spell yeah, police in Turkey. The parks, uh, there was like a interesting building uh, that probably it was like a part of old governmental building uh, with Turkish flag, I don't know. Yeah, I know that there is a wall somehow, that I'm not sure really how. I just know that there are police officers from Turkey here. Yeah, it's I, very odd. Best guess, but just a guess that can be true, because we have a lot of Turkish people transiting all the time to Serbia, and maybe they're somehow helping when there is a case of anything illegal. That's my best guess. Is there? It's not conventional. Like, uh, can you travel to Turkey without a visa? Yes. Without a visa. Yes. Okay. Because yes. yeah, I need a visa, even though, like, you know, obviously. On my way here, I saw a lot of new developments on this side of Belgrade. Yes. New buildings, like modern, extremely modern. Yes, yes, yes. And a lot of them. Yeah. So I was surprised to see that. Business center of Serbia. Mm -hmm. Okay. That's why they build business centers. <laughs> okay. It has uh, electricity in itself. This so, water, this yeah, yeah, Tesla, Tesla water. water. But you won't find it probably because it's rare. But uh -huh. you can order it from their website. Is it expensive? No, uh, one bo one bottle or four or whatever. It's just for fun. Okay. Like uh, the, it's uh, electricity. It shocks you. <laughs> <laughs> Is it sparkling in by no, nature? No, no, no. It's normal, normal water. I think the sparkling version would maybe kill you <laughs> if if <laughs> this gives you yes. electricity. <laughs> yes. And sparkling, so that would be uh -huh. nice. But you can try, and when you uh, like only the first, uh, uh -huh. when you take the first one, so, yeah. it buzz you. Uh -huh. But then when you uh, close it, uh -huh. open it again, it can no again uh, really? buzz you. Yeah, so Do they serve this in prisons, maybe? <laughs> <laughs> no, actually, it's, very, uh, it's a new technology, whatever. Uh -huh. They claim it's healthy, you know, whatever. So I have a presentation when I, uh -huh. on my seminar, like uh, for a faculty, yeah. when we like, uh, uh, exported it to South Korea, but it is exporting uh -huh. to China, to Russia, wow. to Germany, to what, uh, uh, all the countries. So, yeah. Wow, that is so. I mean, it's it's branded as Tesla. Tesla. So, yeah. and I keep forgetting personally that um, th this is an association with Serbia with Nikola Tesla because now my association with Tesla is only like Elon Musk. Elon Musk. Yeah. So I, I was kind of shocked for a second, but it makes sense, you know. Yeah, yeah. Even the airport in Belgrade is Nikola Tesla. So, so I, I get. You. Uh, funny story. You are uh, more being in uh, Belgrade than Tesla. Tesla being in Belgrade just one day. Just one in day. In your in uh, really life. Yeah. Wow, I, I feel like that's an accomplishment <laughs> <laughs> that everyone here in, also in, has. Uh, in uh, Hram, uh, uh, in temple. the temple of uh, Saint Sava, uh -huh. uh, is uh, Tesla uh, um, monument uh, uh, with his uh, remainings. Oh, his skeleton. Uh, yeah, no, no, <laughs> he's uh, burned, right? Yeah, his ash. Yes, yes, yes. Okay, okay, okay. Oh, uh, it's the dairy that you talked about. The dairy, yes. Uh, okay. Dairy. It's not cheese, not the milk. Uh huh. Yes. No, you, you can go. <laughs> Thank you. So, so um, it's some something from these areas. All you right. don't find it anywhere else. And you, you eat it with Piaskavica or Chevapi. Yeah. Mm -hmm. So it, you don't eat it by, by itself because then, uh, but it would uh, join to You mix it. Okay. Yeah. <laughs> looks good. Looks brutal. Brutal piece of meat. I like it. If you want, I can play uh, traditional uh, Vojvodina of museum. Mm -hmm. Music, sorry. Funny <laughs> when uh, 50 people go around and uh, go fast there. <laughs> it's very actually fun. If you go to my party, you will uh, dance. Uh, okay, next week we'll see yeah. people. So we're comparing bust. Ooh, okay. Yours is more colorful. 
Yeah. LGBTQ friendly. Yeah. <laughs> yeah, I guess so. But, but mine's more simplistic. Okay. But it's yeah. also more fancy. Yeah. More this posh, more high class. Uh, <laughs> harsh. This yeah. one looks more fancy. If 